A tent scene this morning at Shadow Ridge High School as Metro and other agencies from around the valley took part in an active shooter training in the wake of school shootings across the country. The intention is to be better prepared. And 13 Action News reporter Tom George now gives us an inside look at their training today. We can still see a lot of the police cars here, and if this were real, this would still be an active scene. In fact, the tape is still up. The goal was to make this as real as possible. It started with an explosion in the parking lot. As crews and bomb squad begin to get to the scene, it becomes clear it was a distraction. You can hear shots fired inside the school as kids run out for safety. The first units on scene form teams and move in, while more help quickly arrives. Tactical units from multiple agencies head in to take on the threat. The choppers circle above. As it turns out, there are two shooters inside, and at one point, a shooter is on the roof. And SWAT units land on the roof and repel in from a rope. In the end, the threat is handled, and they focus on getting kids out safely and treating people who were injured. A very realistic scenario designed to bring Metro together with other agencies, specifically in light of school shootings around the country. It was appropriate for us to conduct an exercise to, to test our preparedness and response to a critical incident. The goal, learn lessons now to be ready for later. To identify them so in the real scenario, we have already identified those issues. 